Hello everyone, thank you for tuning in today for our Friday feature. Today we are in West Gardner and we are very happy to be at Renee Roy's photo studio. I'd like to introduce you to her and she's gonna tell you a little bit about everything she has to offer. So I've been in business since 1998. Um, and I started out working in studios for other photographers in Portland. I was a photo assistant, and that's where I learned um, how to use like lighting and to do a lot of different types of photography and techniques. Um, as I, you know, went on doing that, I realized that I really liked photographing people the most, and I started to do weddings and portraits, and then also started working with commercial clients. Primarily my business is uh, commercial. I do about 70% commercial work. Um, and what I really like to do is um, tell the story of your business. Um, I really like that creative aspect. I mean, I think I apply that all the way across in any photography I do is I am looking for what is the story? Like what's there that's really cool and exciting? And you may think that your business is completely boring, but I guarantee you it isn't. You just need the person that's gonna take the time to find that, you know, angle and just, you know, and show it and show what you do to like help connect you to your clients. Um, and ultimately like bring you more business by just you know engaging people with great photography. So I do corporate headshots um, where I come, I can do them in my studio, I can do not big groups here as you can see it's not very large but I can do one-ups um, or a couple people can come. Right now I would be spacing people out due to, due to COVID and just have like one person come at a time um, but I can also bring my setup to you um, I can do environmental, which means, you know, I would take your office space or your, um, your foyer and kind of rearrange things and have your photo in there to kind of show your business if you like that look. Um, and then I also can just show, you know, like a mock meeting, like more like marketing pieces, like what, what does your business do? Like, let's, how, how do you interact with your client? We can even go to locations if that's what you want to do, or you have a factory I can show how your factory works and what your workers do. Um, I also cover uh, events. So if you have a fundraising event and you wanna show that or even a appreciation event for your employees, I do that sort of coverage like parties. Um, I do a lot with colleges. So like I work with USM and Bates and uh, UMaine Augusta showing like campus life, but also like the types of events they do and um, you know, professors interacting with students, that sort of sort of thing. So pretty much anything, uh, anything you want to do with your business, I can do that. All right, so I figured it might be fun to do like a little behind the scenes and <laughs> Katie has graciously agreed to be in a photograph. So, um, so this is an example of what I would bring to your business to set up like if we decided to do a backdrop. Believe it or not, all this stuff collapses down and folds up into these little cases that I bring with me. Well, they aren't really that little, but, but cases that I bring with me into your business and just, you know, set this up in a boardroom or whatever. So, Katie, going to put your name in the computer here. Okay. And what I do is I shoot right to this laptop. So we're going to take some shots of you. Then we can look at them and you're going to get to pick today. So okay. if you don't like them, we can shoot some more. No worries there, okay? So I'm gonna put you in a bunch of different poses and then we'll come and check these out. It's really important for you to have a photograph that you feel represents you and that you feel like you have a good smile. Um, you know, that's, and you deserve to have that, you know, and have someone take the time to make sure that you're happy with the photo. You know, I shoot right to a laptop when we do your photo so that you get to pick it out that day. And um, my clients love that because I don't wanna come back for a reshoot and I don't want you to be stressed out about how you're gonna look. So that kind of takes the stress right out of it. If we go and we look and you say, oh man, my hair had a weird part in it right there. And I, I didn't realize that because I don't know that you don't part your bags. Then I say, let's fix it. I even, if someone's really stressing about clothes, I say, bring a few, bring a few shirts, bring a few jackets, I'll help you. You know pick what's best so we would be like oh do you you know is that one is that a possibility do you like that one yeah so it's like I kind of just do that and then it's like we would mark all our all our blue ones so that one's pretty good too what do you say yeah 
So you would go through this with the client, yeah, mark the exactly couple. this is exactly what I do. Like we just go through, I well, probably don't like that one as much. Which as is as kind of good on your side too. So you're not editing a bunch of photos that they really didn't exactly. like. Exactly, exactly. So it's kind of easier for, for everybody. I also um, provide some family portraiture and um, wedding photography as well. Uh, Again, there, my goal is for it to like be um, real and authentic, fresh. I want it to be about you. Um, you know, I, like everyone thinks that their family is crazy. Like everyone thinks, oh, I, I don't know. Oh, my family's crazy. My kids are going to cry. They're going to be bad. Everybody worries about that. It's like, don't worry about it. I schedule the time. I don't do photos inside. We do them outside. I think that's more comfortable. You'll see um, some of my images come through on this and you'll see the type of thing I go for. It's like, I'm going to help you get into, you know, poses. I'm not just going to leave you hanging, but I'm also going to make it so that maybe we can laugh a little and have some fun and relax. And you're going to get, you know, stuff that just shows like you, what you and your family are really like. And the same for weddings, you know, I'm looking to just capture like, what is the story of your day? Like, what are you like as a couple? Um, who are all these family and friends that are there to support you in your life and on your day? You know, I don't want to recreate like the same moment over and over. I'm always looking for what's what's new and what's real. You know, like an authentic and engaging photograph. Or that also something, you know, if it's for family and wedding, something that's like really meaningful to you that you're gonna, you know, cherish, so. So with my portrait clients, I really like to focus on helping people get prints and gifts for others that they can share um, rather than just you know, here's your digital negatives and it's all on you. Because I think in so many cases with that, people just never get back to it. And you know, you enjoy it on the computer for a little bit, share it on Facebook, and then it just disappears. Um, so, you know, when you work with me, after we do our shoot, you come here and I, you know, show you a slideshow of all the pictures that we took. And then I help you select the best ones. Like I'll, I'll come up with some ideas of things that you can do, like maybe a wall grouping, um, and you know, or if you wanted to do some cards or something. So, but you can get whatever you want, and I'm going to help you come up with you know what size is going to work for you, what product, um, and help you narrow it down because it is very overwhelming. At first, you're going to be like, I love them all. I could never ever choose, but you'll be surprised how you know we go through and we just start to narrow it down. And then we get it down to like your super favorites and then that's when we can decide on gifts and something really nice for you to hang on your wall that you can enjoy every day. Um, so I offer canvases, um, which is kind of your more traditional style. I'm sure you've seen, you've seen them before because these have been around a bit. Um, I like the one that I offer though because it's um, actually from the same company that I get my wood blocks from and they wrap a canvas around the block so there's no way that it can get like a hole punctured in it or anything and it won't sag because it's you know nice and tight wrapped around and then the other product I offer are these wood blocks which are a little bit modern they have a little bit of a sheen to them they're printed on like a metallic paper um, and again they're just like super lightweight ready to hang I just use a finish nail like you don't have to find a stud or anything even for something even larger than this you just need like a couple finish nails and you're all set and that's a lot easier than having to go out and find you know a frame and stuff but i do also offer you know framed prints as well and you see a few around um and you're just you i don't offer framing so you just have to go find your own your own frames but you can get in touch with me on Facebook, Instagram, or also my website, and I would love it if you just stopped in and browsed around and looked at my pictures. For the rest of the year, I'm looking to still book uh, current clients or new clients for their marketing needs for businesses. I don't do a lot of portraiture in the winter because I mostly do outdoor, although from time to time I might throw in a fresh snow session if someone's interested in uh, getting up early in the morning and throwing on some hats and mittens for that. Thanks for tuning in today for our Friday feature featuring Renee Roy Photography. Hopefully you learned a little bit more about everything she has to offer and you check her out soon. Thanks. <laughs>